Alright everybody, I'm back, and now we are going to be doing some more loyalty mission. So let's go. Hey, do you know where to get tickets for Expel 10? I heard this amazing Asari say they were her favorite band. I wanna... I just want whatever she wants. I gotta find tickets. Expel 10 is playing tomorrow. What kind of music do they play? They're a sensory band. Like, they crawl into you and make you feel things. And this Asari digs them like you wouldn't believe. I could score way out of my league, you know? You gotta help me. She sounds amazing. Is she here? She was here a couple of days ago talking about the band. She's here a lot. When she comes back, I'm gonna have tickets. I don't have any tickets. If you score some, I got some creds for you. you to step away you want in on this transaction hey i don't care if it's you or this bitch i just like good times how about you back off oh! eh. good times are over thanks for that security was asleep I'll dance next to you. If you want to think we're dancing together, go ahead. I do want to think that. Must be drunk. Although, Shepard, no offense, but you are a terrible dancer. I don't talk to people. You're scary. I bet you What'll you have? These are good people, but they look bored. Board people don't spend much. And you got an idea for how I could fix that? A round of drinks shows that you appreciate their business. Your rep will improve and you'll make more money in the end. Maybe worth a try once. You better be right. Listen up, everyone! We love having you here, so a round of drinks on the house! My name is Morin. I've been watching wow. you. You're the most quick. interesting person in this place. I've got a booth over here in the shadows. Why don't you come sit with me? Some nights I come here and there's no one interesting to talk to. Some nights, there's just one person. Tonight, it's you. Why is that? You tell me. <laughs> I can't tell you why you're special. I've traveled all over the galaxy. It changes you, doesn't it? Real travel means going to dangerous places. Where you can see and do things most people can't imagine. Yes. When I travel, I find myself drawn to dark, dangerous places. Violent places? Violence is the surest expression of power. If you're the strongest, you have the power. That's certainly true. Among children. Whoever wants it the most is willing to do anything for it. Has the power. Are you willing to do anything for it? I haven't decided yet. Now you're toying with me. Do you know anything about art? It speaks to the darkest places in me. What about you? Do you know the artist Forta? I didn't think anyone around here knew him. He's sublime. Art comes in many varieties. I've seen vids that were more powerful than a sculpture sitting in a gallery. Do you know Veenya? My favorite. The two actresses on it are so glamorous. I'll have to watch it. Maybe we could do that together. 
What do you think of the music here? Dark rhythms, violent pulses. It stirs something primitive in me. What about you? I'm curious about a band called Expel 10. They get in my head and tear it to pieces. They're in concert soon. Maybe we should go together. You can lose yourself in the music here. There are ways to enhance that. You know? What do you think of Alex? Do you want to get out of here? My apartment is nearby and I want you alone. There's some more watching it. They should be telling us now. If you want, but wouldn't you rather have all your senses be clear and sharp right now? Yes, I do. Yeah. A gift from a suitor. The statue's got more personality than he did. Still, he impressed me enough that he finally got what he wanted. It didn't end the way he hoped. I love any game where your opponent can believe he is about to win just before you kill him. I love clubs. People, movement, heat. I can still hear the bass like the drums of a great hunt out for your blood. But here, it's muted, and you're safe. Is that what you want, Shepard? People feel safest right before they die. It's true. We're never safe. I've never understood the fascination with safety. Some of us choose differently. Independence over submission? I think we share that, you and I. We've both killed many times, but that's where the similarities end. Why do you say that I've killed? What do you know? Let's stop playing games. Look into my eyes and tell me you want me. Tell me you'd kill for me. Anything I want. Surprise. Don't count on it. But you... Who are you? Oh no. I see what's going on. The bitch herself found a little helper. Marin! Uh, mother. Do not call me that. I can't choose to stop being your daughter, mother. You made your choice long ago. What choice? My only crime is being born with the gift you gave me! Enough, Moran! I am the genetic de destiny of the Asari. But they are not ready to reveal this. So I must die. You are a disease to be purged. Nothing more. I'm as strong as she is. Let me join you. I am already sworn to help you, Shepard. Let us finish this. End of the line, Morin. And they call me a monster. Wow. And I be able to do more than this. Find peace in the embrace of the goddess. But Morin's was evil. I can't hear. I am ready to leave this place and get on with my life. Are you ready to go as well? Do you want to talk about what happened? Shepard. What do you think I will say? What can I say? I just killed the bravest and smartest of my daughters. There are no words. I will try another time. For now, show mercy on a broken old warrior and let us leave. Let's go. Marga. I'm going to recruit Tally next. Maybe I'm going to do a little off screen stuff. Like exploring plans and scanning resources. And then I'm going to do some more loyalty missions. And 
and then I'm going to well after I, after I do all the scanning stuff in the town, I'm going to get Thane, then do some more ultimations. Now, let's see the ninja. How may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should know? Nothing right now. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. Good luck out there, Shepard. Let's go talk to Garrison Smart. Tomorrow, I'm using I can kill the most powerful, bold, and strongest of the daughters. I wonder which is going to be. Morinth haunted my dreams and waking hours equally. For the first time in 400 years, I am free. I am a ruined vessel of sorrow and regret, but I am free. It is not a feeling I can describe. You did your duty. What about your feelings? One of my daughters is dead. My hopes, my dreams were all bound up in my children. Still, my feelings have always come after my duty. The same is true of you. You said that Morinth was a monster, but she was still your daughter. She was the strongest and smartest. She would not accept the injustice thrust upon her. She fought to the end. I am so proud of her, Shepard. Was it worth it? It was never a question of worth, but of need. I had to take the action I did, as did she. This was never a story that would have a happy outcome. What will you do now that Morinth is gone? Assuming I survive your mission? I am a Justicar. Injustice still exists. And perhaps even other Ardat Yakshi. Morinth claimed that her condition was the future of the Asari race. Morinth would say anything that served her cause. Ardat Yakshi are sterile, Shepard. That wouldn't be a particularly viable future for my people. There's no way to correct the condition Morinth had? We are an advanced species, but we don't have magic. When the trait manifests at maturity, it is too late for mitigation. It only occurs in purebloods like myself. Perhaps that is the root of the stigma regarding Asari exclusive pairings. I don't know. I thought Ardat Yakshi were extremely rare. Asari have spread to many worlds. There are remote regions with no government oversight. If I travel to those worlds and they do exist, I will find them. You don't want to settle down? I did. I returned to my homeworld and tried to start a family. I will fight and struggle all my life. That is my fate. When I die, it will not be in bed. I am at peace with that. You still control the direction of your life. I have chosen this path. I truly am at peace. Due in no small part to you. Oh. Good I can't believe the Collectors were once Protheans. I always pictured the Protheans being legal, not giant bodies. Who knows what the Reapers did to them? Crazy. Commander, so what can I do for you? Do you have a minute, Miranda? 
There's a lot to do, Shepard. Yep. <laughs> of course, Commander. Shepard, need me for something? Have you got a minute? Yeah. I've been thinking about what we talked about. Blowing off steam, easing tension. I've never considered cross-species intercourse. And damn, saying it that way doesn't help. Now I feel dirty and clinical. Uh, are we crazy to even be thinking about this? I'm not... Sh Look, Shepard, I know you can find something a little closer to home. I don't want something closer to home. I want you. I want someone I can trust. I can do that. I'll find some music and do some research to figure out how this thing should work. It'll either be a night to treasure or a horrible interspecies awkwardness thing. <laughs> yes, that is. In which case, fighting the collectors will be a welcome distraction, so, you know, a win either way. You know, Garrus, if you're not comfortable with this, it's okay. I'm not trying to pressure you. Shepard, you're about the only friend I've got left in this screwed up galaxy. I'm not gonna pretend I've got a fetish for humans. But this isn't about that. This is about us. You don't ever have to worry about making me uncomfortable. Nervous, yes. But never uncomfortable. So when should I book the room? I'd wait, if you're okay with it. Disrupt the crew as little as possible and take that last chance to find some calm just before the storm. You know me, I always like to savor the last shot before popping the heat sink. <laughs> Wait. That metaphor just went somewhere horrible. You're really bad at this. I'll let you get back to work. Right. Because I'm in a great place to optimize firing algorithms right now. That was funny. Sorry if my laugh's over here. I'm like, uh, I fell to sleep. She took a lot of fun in that one. And look at that, tomorrow's now also left. So we know people aren't going yet are mainly probably because I've knocked off the head. Whoever that person would be Zaidi Samara. Um Morden and Lunch and Jack. Yeah. Okay, we'll move on. Alright guys, well, I'm out of time, so talk to you later. Sorry.